weekend, a lot of complaints from Democrats about uh, the Comey uh, replacement process. Uh, first of all, that Jeff Sessions is leading the search. There are a lot of Democrats that think that because he refused himself from the Russian investigation, he should not be in that position. Uh, secondly, some Democrats in the Senate are saying that before they will consider the President's next nominee, they want a special prosecutor appointed to look into the Russia investigation. Can you respond to both of them? I think this is a process that's running um, completely as it should, as being headed by the Deputy Attorney General and the Attorney General. Uh, as you've, we've noted in the past, the FBI Director reports to the Deputy Attorney General. Uh, they continue to move through a series of highly qualified candidates. Uh, and it's, you know, obviously this is a huge priority for the President to make sure that we have someone that has uh, the ability to administer the proper leadership uh, to the FBI. And is that on the special prosecutor? I, I think that's, there, there's frankly no need for a special prosecutor. We've discussed this before. You have two Senate committees uh, that are looking into this. The FBI is conducting uh, their own review. And uh, and I think if you even look at what Acting Director McCabe said last week, made it very clear that they have the resources that they need uh, and that the work continues. Uh, but the bottom line is, again, I think part of it is there's a difference between what we've talked about in that and it's been made very clear that there's been, uh, with respect to the President himself, both Senator Schumer, Senator Feinstein, Senator Manchin, and everyone else who have been briefed on this have been very clear that there was no collusion with, the, with respect to the President himself and no investigation there. Blake. Thank you. Let me pick up